Hey, what's up, you guys? I'm here with another Windows tip. Today, I'm going to be telling you how to disable these annoying pop-ups um, for when you hold down the shift button for 8 seconds or you press it 5 times. Now, this can be quite annoying, especially if you're a gamer and you just, you know, you use the shift button for certain things, whether that's macros, running, or, or anything, basically. Um, so, if you hold down the shift button, this is what you get. You get the filter keys. And it says right here, the keyboard shortcut to turn on filter key is to hold down the right shift key for 8 seconds. Now, I usually just close this, okay? And the other one, the sticky keys, would be if you press the shift key 5 times. As so. And this is what you get. Do you want to turn on the sticky keys? And I just exit. Now, this is quite annoying when you're gaming um, because it distracts you, it takes you off from um, your actual game and you know you could probably lose the match if you're playing you know RP, uh, MMO or something so the first thing you want to do to go ahead and disable this is you want to go to the start menu once at the start menu go to where it says control panel and click it once in the control panel go to where it says ease of access in ease of access Go and click where it says Ease of Access Center. Always in this section. Now you're going to hear, you know, the Ease of Access Center say something that I did not understand. And you're going to go down to where it says Make the Keyword Easier to Use and click it. Alright. So, first we're going to disable the sticky keys. So, um, where it says uh, Set of Sticky Keys, which is under Make it Easier to Type. Uh, go ahead and click set up sticky keys and uh, uncheck where it says turn on sticky keys when shift is pressed five times go ahead and hit apply and OK now we're gonna go ahead and turn off the filter keys which is the one where you press uh, the shift button for eight seconds so go to where it says set up filter keys now as you can see it's checked um, has a check where it says turn on filter keys when right shift is pressed for eight seconds. We're gonna go ahead and uncheck this box and hit apply. Hit OK. Now to exit this and I'm gonna go ahead and press the shift button five times to see if it works. One, two, three, four, five, none. And the filter keys one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight nothing all right so that means this actually worked um so that pretty much does it for this tutorial but before i let you go i want you to go ahead and subscribe to my um uh, joint channel with this guy on youtube named cosmo knight 74 we started a youtube channel called extreme pc reviews and there will be a lot more uh, reviews and unboxings and giveaways um, from products that uh, are sponsored to us. Uh, we have an actual giveaway going on right now, which is the Dynatron Evo 11. Uh, it's a CPU cooler, so you might want to go ahead and check that out and hit the subscribe button. Um, and also, subscribe to my other channel, Your Noob 2007. Um, I am going to be starting posting different things on this channel, and on Your Noob 2007, so that they get um, more traffic to them. Alright, you guys. Well, that pretty much does it for this video, guys. If you have any comments uh, or questions or any concerns, uh, please remember to uh, send me a private message or a comment, and I'll do my best to answer that question. Alright, that does it for this video, guys. Uh, please remember to comment, rate, and subscribe for more videos to come. I'm Elmer. I'm signing out. Thanks for watching.